That's my name. I grew up named Kostaki Economopolis. Yeah, in Georgia. And my first job was on a construction site, so I got a whole lot of, why don't you run them two by fours down there, Kawasaki Econo Lodge? Sweep that house out, Suzuki Snuffleupagus. I've heard them all, man. Kabuki Metropolis, Karaoke Streptococcus. Those are all real. Names are weird. I have a buddy who has the same name as someone who snapped and shot a bunch of people at the malls. Now he has that association with his name. See, I will never have that problem. If you hear that Kostaki Economopolis shot people at the mall, it was me. <laughs> it's nice, I get to control that. I'm a married man, I've been married four years now. We know the odds, right? 50% of marriages end in divorce. And the other half end in death. So we know going in, it's not gonna end well. <laughs> We're rooting for death. <laughs> ah, honey, I hope this ends in a death. I hope one of us dies and the other one's nearby and sad. That's how we know we won. <laughs> if I was a divorce lawyer, my slogan would be, it's the only way to get out of this alive. Love my wife. She's though completely obsessed with unplugging the toaster, which I've never even heard of. Apparently it's a fire hazard. She's yelling at me from the other room. Unplug the toaster, you're gonna burn the place down. Like I can't even burn the toast unless I push it down twice. <laughs> a toaster is a self-contained metal box on a stone slab. Might be this the whole safest thing in the whole place. If a toaster breaks in the on position the whole day you're at work, what would happen? It would just gently warm the area immediately around the toaster. I'm like, honey, the two wooden spoons are a bigger fire hazard. There could be an earthquake and they might rub against each other. <laughs> Unplug the toaster, it's dangerous. Meanwhile, she's lighting a candle underneath a curtain. She's setting a curling iron on a newspaper. Like, honey, the, it's, yeah. the butter next to the toaster is a bigger hazard to our lives, right? Generations of economopoli have been dropping dead from heart disease <laughs> since the beginning of time. No one's ever died from a runaway toaster fire. <laughs> have you ever even heard of one? You go to work, your friend's all covered in black char. What happened, dude? Really? Another toaster fire? <laughs> Tough month. The other thing my wife does that drives me bananas, I'll ask her where she wants to eat, and she will say to me, oh, I don't know, you pick. Yeah, yeah you're familiar? <laughs> then I pick, then she winces, and says, could we not go there? <laughs> yeah, we cannot go there. In fact, here's the magic of communication. We can go to exactly the place that you want to go. All you have to do is say what it is. <laughs> Why are we playing a crazy game right now? I'm hungry. <laughs> hey guys, watch my entire special for 99 cents. All you gotta do is click here. You can also watch more clips. That's a clickable thing. And you can also subscribe to another click. You're on the internet. Everyone's clicking all the time. Click it already. Click.